CrossFit Press On, welcome to another Saturday Stronger Together workout. Today's wad is a 20 minute AMRAP of 200 meter run, 25 deadlifts at 135 pounds for men and 95 pounds for ladies. If you have a barbell or 50 pound dumbbells for men and 35 dumbbells for ladies, if you don't have a barbell and 10 box jumps at 24 inches for men and 20 inches for ladies. The warm up today is going to consist of a Tabata style warm up of 20 seconds of jumping jacks, which look like this, followed by 10 seconds of rest, followed by 20 seconds of mountain climbers. You start in the push up position, either step your feet outside of your hands or jump your feet outside of your hands, keeping your hips low, keeping your core tight. Whatever you do, keep moving for those 20 seconds, followed by 10 seconds of rest. We are going to do four rounds of that. Then we are going to do two rounds of hollow holds, I'm sorry, hollow rocks, 15 seconds, maintaining that hollow position, legs straight, arms overhead, back flat, rocking. If that's too difficult, you can bring your knees in, bring your arms in, followed by 10, and 10 reps on each side of dynamic calf stretch, where you're again in that pike position, one foot on your heel, driving up and slowly pressing down to get a stretch in your calves. And then we are going to do, if you have access to a rubber band, we're gonna do 10 monster walks to the left, 10 to the right. So make sure you're in that little quarter squat, your hips stay low, knees stay behind your, your toes. Step out, leading with your heel, 10 times in each direction. And then we're gonna go forward 10 times, stepping out at about a 45 degree angle, bring your feet together, forwards, and 10 steps backwards. If you don't have a small loop, you can use a large band, put it around your shoulders, Step into the band, the same thing. After that, we're gonna move into a little bit of movement prep. We are going to do 10 RDLs. You can hold a single dumbbell, two dumbbells, an empty barbell. And what you're gonna do just keep your chest up, send those hips back, letting them be slightly bend so you get a good stretch in your hamstrings. Squeeze your butt and stand up. Keeping that weight close to your body, warming up those hamstrings. Then we are going to do five burpee squats. So you're going to get down into that burpee position Jump up into a squat. Jump back out into that first push up position. Jump your feet out into a squat for five reps. Then we're going to do five, five single leg RDLs. So I recommend using a dumbbell or a kettlebell. You're going to hold the weight in the opposite hand of the leg you're standing on. Again, chest up. You can lift that other leg back. Bend over, keep that knee behind your toe, keep your back nice and straight. Try to touch that weight to the ground right next to your ankle. If you have difficulty balancing or it's too difficult, you can have that back leg toe on the ground. Just make sure that you're sending your hips back, touching and then standing up. After that, you're going to do 10 After that, we're going to do five low box jumps. When you are doing a box jump, make sure that you have room where you're jumping, where your head doesn't hit the ceiling. Make sure you have a soft landing, feet flat on the surface. If you don't have access to a box, 
you are going to do tuck jumps. So you are going to squat down, jump up, and tuck your knees to your chest. Then we are going to do 10 deadlifts. If you have a bar, you're going to start with the empty bar. If you have a broom, you can use a broom if you want. Thumbs width grip from hips. Chest up. Starting bar at the mid shin. Send those hips back. Squeeze those shoulders, engage your lats. Drive, pull those knees back. Squeeze your butt and stand. Send your hips back. And then lower the bar to the ground. If you are using dumbbells or kettlebells, you'll be doing a suitcase deadlift. So you're gonna basically do the same thing, but you're gonna hold the weights right at your sides. Those shoulders back, hips back. Touch the heads of the dumbbells to the ground and stand up. Then you are going to do 10 high box jumps. So we're gonna then move into a uh, build up round of two rounds of a 100 meter run at your pace for the workout, five deadlifts increasing up to the working weight, and three box jumps building up to your workout height. For the cool down, we are going to do three rounds of 30 second calf stretch where you have your foot up on a wall, a box, an object, and you lean forward until you feel a good stretch in your calf, keeping your knee straight. And 30 seconds of a banded hamstring stretch. If you have a band, you can use it. If you have a towel, a dog leash, or a belt, you can use that. But you're gonna lie down on the ground, your opposite leg stays straight, and you're gonna pull your leg up into the air so you get a good stretch in your hamstrings. We're gonna do three rounds of that, 30 seconds each leg for each stretch. I hope you enjoy your Saturday workout, and I hope you join us for the happy hour with our special guest this evening.